All right, here with Jeff Mayweather inside the Mayweather Boxing Club. Thank you so much for taking the time, sir. Big news. You just were in Puerto Rico watching Jake. You all right? Yeah. Watching Jake Paul fight, and here he is already announcing his next fight. He's taking on the legendary Mike Tyson. Thoughts on that fight? Um, I think it's very interesting. Um, and is this going to be an exhibition? They, uh, they haven't announced that yet. That's kind of up yeah. in the air, it seems like. Yeah, because, I mean, if it's an exhibition, they can implement certain clauses where, you know, there's no knockout clause and things like that. If, if that's the case, um... Yeah, and plus, if it's an exhibition, no, and nobody wins. Well, considering uh, Tyson's, you know, you know, pushing sixty, and Jake Paul's one of the hottest prospects in the sport right now. Do you think it's better if it is an exhibition for, uh, for basically for the health of Mike Tyson? Um, no, I think Mike Tyson knows more than Jake Paul will ever know. Well, he might know more, and but that that doesn't. Mean, you might does, know more than Jake mean, Paul, it, it but it does you could, mean something. It means something because that's that's what he did as a living. And that's what he did as a living, and, and he was one of he's one of the greatest fighters in the world that ever did it. Yeah, but he did it. Jake Paul does it. That counts for a lot too. He does what? He's a boxer, so he's How current many though. How before? He's just How got many done fighting a boxer. He just got done fighting a boxer. Exactly one, two. He lost he, to one, and he beat. And the, the, his beat first the other ten one. fights, he fought tougher people than Tyson fought his first ten fights. Yeah, he sure did. If I, if I, if MMA fighters that, that don't know anything about boxing. Uh, several of them had fought pro with him before, but Tyson, last time we saw him was 20-something years ago, whatever, against uh, Kevin McBride, and he lost that fight. Mm -hmm. and, and, and you think he's going to beat Jake Paul at this point? Yeah, I think so. I don't know. I mean... I, I think so. I think that... I think there's one, the fight's probably going to be interesting, but I think the one thing is this, is that the last thing to go with any fighter is their power. And Mike Tyson is a, is, a, is a knockout guy. I mean, and if Tyson trains for this fight and really get in tip-top shape, you know, I mean, and, you know, and and take this fight serious, I think Jake Paul's going to get hurt. I mean, Tyson, obviously, legendary power, but do you think at this point he's he's punching anywhere near as hard as Jake Paul does? <laughs> I didn't even answer that. Well, you can't because I mean he's I mean look he's had back to back knockouts in the first round over two guys. Yeah, Ty he, he Tyson just, hasn't knocked out anybody he, in twenty something years. He just, he just knocked out. He just knocked out a guy with a seventeen that, and two record. Yeah, they haven't fought in seven years with a seventeen and two record. With so 17, seventeen and two, seventeen and two record that was punchy. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, you, so the one thing that's kind of fascinating is so you know, Mike Tyson, one of the top two or three most famous boxers of all time for sure, still probably one of the two or three most famous boxers in the world. Then you have Jake Paul, uh, you know, a social media superstar at this point. You certainly couldn't get any bigger interest than it probably would be in this in these two fighting. That's true. No, that's true. And, I mean, I just think that, like I said, I think that Mike Tyson only needs one punch. Jake Paul going to need a whole lot more than one punch. He's not going to knock no Mike Tyson out. Uh, you, you know, I, I am kind of surprised that Jake took this fight because, you know, he said, I want to fight boxers, I want to fight boxers, I want to fight boxers. Obviously, Tyson's a boxer, but it's kind of going against what he said because he's not a current boxer, right? He's not someone has been in there. He's not been active. I mean, obviously, the paycheck's going to be insane. The interest will be insane. But do you think it's kind of a step back for Jake to fight someone like Mike Tyson when he should be moving forward and fighting people a little more on his age, a little more, uh, you know, current and, you know, relevant in the sport? Well, but also, I see... The one thing I can see is if you fight Mike Tyson. I'm not fighting Mike Tyson. I'm not talking about you. You just said you. If Jake fights Mike, Mike Tyson, I mean, it's actually it's beneficial for him either way. I mean, because no one thinks he's going to win. And if he wins... I think most and, and, I think most educated boxing fans will think that he's going to win. Well, they ain't educated then. I mean, I was going to say, don't you think it's kind of a no no lose or no win situation for Jake if he? No, I think it's a no lose situation for Jake. If he loses, well, he you know, I mean, if he wins, so so what? He beat a you know almost sixty year old you know guy that hasn't you know been on a winning I mean, streak that, in, that in much, decades. That much is true. And if he loses, and if he loses, he lost to Mike. You know, a guy at yeah, sixty lost, years old. He lost to Mike Tyson. A sixty-year-old, and, 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 that, and that's that's like okay, we all expected that. So, so what? 
I mean, when was Tyson, and no disrespect, because the guy's a legend, obviously, great, great fighter, one of the best to ever do it, but when was the last time that he was good? Well, last time In the 1990s. Good? Early 1990s. Yeah. So this is 2024. I mean, what does Jake have to win by beating him? The, the, what Jake has to win by beating him is that he was one of the greatest fighters that ever lived. And that'll be on his resume. Well, he might as well fight you then. No, I ain't on, I ain't on that level. <laughs> <laughs> so, I, I mean, so you, you honestly think that Tyson's got a... Uh, I think Tyson's got a, Tyson's got a chance. Yes, I do. I, I really think he does a, I think that he's, he's, fast, he's still faster than Jake Paul. I mean, I still see Mike I think he's Tyson. faster too? Yeah, he's faster. I think he's faster than Jake Paul. And I mean, the, the one thing is this, is that we still have seen Mike Tyson working out. We still seen him working out, even in even even today. We still see Mike Tyson working out, and so the thing is, is that if Mike Tyson can still do a third of the stuff that he was doing, he has a chance of knocking Jake Paul out. Well, I, I was a Bruce Lee, or someone said, you know, pads don't hit back or whatever. The saying, you know, it's great. You know, anyone can look good in training, right? Uh -huh. But uh... yeah, but Mike Tyson did it when it counted too. Yeah, did it like you get past tense again? It's it's this is a different era, you know. It's, yeah, it's, this, it's a different era. But who has Jake Paul fought to even have anyone say that he can beat Mike Tyson? Anyone? He's he got robbed in his only pro loss, and he's he would so he should he be did. ten and zero. He did. Absolutely, he did. Oh, well, I'm not just. I didn't I'm, see it. I I'm saying it. It, if this was Mike Tyson from 1989 walking in there, it's one thing. This yeah. is 2024 Mike Tyson, yeah, and, Mike, and it... I mean, Mike Tyson, of course, Mike Tyson ain't, ain't Mike Tyson that he used to be, of course. But he still has his power. He still has his power. Could even knock out Roy Jones. Yeah, because... They had Everybody knocked out Roy Jones. <laughs> at the end, at the and end, Roy, another... And Roy, and Roy Jones was one of the best fighters in the world ever. Exactly. Two. So but he was past it, so but at, at the end, he was two. getting knocked out but in they his both fights. But they both were way past their prime. Yeah. So, so I'm but saying that's two great fighters fighting each other past their prime. So they're now not, he's stepping up not. against a current great fighter. <laughs> I ain't no damn great. I don't know nothing about no great. He's uh, he's he's obviously heading trajecting, uh, having a trajectory towards a, a potential world title shot at some point here in the future. So he's he's obviously well, doing something yeah, he right. Has, he has value. There you go. Anybody that has value can get a title shot. Anybody that has value. Kind of value that he well, has. Why isn't Mike Tyson getting a title shot now? Because Mike Tyson ain't fighting. Mike Tyson is retired. Exactly. So he's, he's fighting. Exactly. So now he's going to come out of retirement for 20 yeah, something years and fight one out, of the. Yes, yes he's going to come out. He's going to come out of retirement and he's going to beat Jake Paul. Uh, you're always you always show favorites of the older guys, Jeff. I think you need to appreciate this new generation of fighter and the talent of um, people like Jake Paul yeah, bring. I, I, I think that. Um. I think that Jake has gotten better, but I don't think Jake can can pull off, you know, beating Mike Tyson. Well, I guess we'll leave it at that. We'll agree to disagree. But um, what do you, do you, I mean, do you think this should be an exhibition? Would you want to see it? Like I said, from what I, I read, I couldn't wanna, see anything. See, it might as well be a real fight. Yeah. Because, I mean, exhibition has too many too many clauses that, that are hidden that nobody knows about. Yeah. But if saying, you're going to really do something, do it. Do it without all the stipulations of, oh, no knockout rule, no this, you can't do this, you can't do that. If you're going to fight, if you call this man out, let him fight. Let I, him fight with, with no rules. No rules, so biting and about so he can bite his ear off. Nothing but boxing rules. Tyson, oh. Tyson might do that anyway. <laughs> <laughs> so I guess it's going to be on Netflix here, so there's a chance they're saying this might be the most watched fight of this century. Beat Manny, Connor, all those, because... Obviously, those are pay-per-views. This is Netflix, so you better watch it free through subscription. So I guess it's gonna be a movie. Uh, we'll see. <laughs> I mean, maybe it might be a really short one, maybe, like one-round movie. It might be scripted. <laughs> so you think there's a chance that Tyson's the third consecutive first-round knock knockout by uh, Jake Paul? I, I don't think so. I don't think so. All I right. Think, I, yeah, I just I think that I think Tyson's gonna win. I think that, and I think there's gonna probably be, but. I just hate the fact that if it's an exhibition with them hidden claws, nobody knows what's going to happen. So I'm not going to say Tyson's going to do whatever whatever he's going to do, but if Tyson fights a fight and they fight a fight where 
It's it's no rules. Tyson's gonna knock him out. Last question: Do you think this does anything for either's legacy, win or lose? Well, it does. It does something for Jake. I mean, the guy that started out as a YouTuber to to, to get a win over a legend, no matter how old he is. And I then think, let's say he loses. I mean, and if, and probably it, nothing because he lost to Tyson. Yeah, it, 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 yeah. It doesn't it doesn't hurt him to lose to Mike Tyson, and and it doesn't do nothing for Mike Tyson because the oh, first thing they're gonna say is that Mike Tyson was too old. Yeah. You know, so I mean, it's a, it's it's a, it's a it's one of those situations where it, it don't matter who who really actually wins. Maybe unless it's like some kind of massive knockout. Yeah, some sort that, of. That's that's what I'm saying. I mean, and that's why I'm saying that if. It's a fight that's not an exhibition with all those hidden clauses. And they actually do fight to try to really, you know, take each other's head off. You know, I think that then it's worth seeing. But if you put it on Netflix, it, it maybe it's a movie. And maybe it's fixed like a movie. All right, Jeff. Appreciate it. <laughs> all right.